So in the patriarch section of the Bible, we hear what seems to be almost rather hyper hyperbolic uh -huh. um, and grand explanations of these stories, beginning with the ages of the fathers to the flooding of the whole earth and the filling of a huge ark with two of every animal. Mm -hmm. So my question is, what is your view of these stories? Are they more on the side of Moses speaking to his people and language and story that they would know and help them to understand God's character? Or is it literal? And if literal, um, what is your explanation or view of, say, these ages of these men and fitting every animal into the boat? Okay, well, first of all, I think they're literal because, first of all, there is a ancient, there are ancient flood stories in virtually every ancient civilization. Uh, and you might say, well, how did they get there? Because there probably was an ancient flood. Secondly, uh, the long lives of people that actually is also testified in the Sumerian king list, which is the, probably one of the oldest civilizations, uh, which comes from the Fertile Crescent, where we would call Iraq now. They have kings that live for thousands of years as well. It seems like after the flood, there was some kind of, of change where people wouldn't live as long. But you have from other cultures, stories of floods and stories of people long, living extremely long lifespans. So I think they're literal. And uh, I think if you do the math, you can fit uh, two of every kind on an ark. In fact, there is an ark uh, expedition somewhere there in Kentucky, Kentucky right? Yeah. Is it Kentucky? Yeah. Um, so if you do the math, it can happen. Now, what Christians argue over is, was this a universal flood or a local flood? And I don't, I'm not going to get into that now. That would take too long. There's arguments on both sides. It meant local flood where people were, not literally the whole earth, okay? So, yeah, I, and of course, if, if God exists, if Genesis 1-1 is true, Noah, Jonah, all these other miracles, God can easily pull off. Does that make sense? Yep, that makes sense. Thank all you. All right, thanks, Noah. And Noah, of course, asking the question about the flood. It's perfect. 